Let's examine the light. Every time I make a comment, there's no light. I was waiting for you. Great, now I'm here. There's a freaking coffin in the corner, dude. This is for you, Armin. Leave the house. Hey, I'm Jay from the Cubs House. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games. As here is where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet, and I play them for you right here in this video. I can't promise you that they're gonna be any good, but I can promise you that we're gonna have some fun. So if you guys cool with that, you down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! First game of today's episode is called Nine Child Street Demo. You are somebody who sees something weird going on in your neighbor's house right across the street. So you are gonna go figure out what it's all about. The developer actually emailed me and asked me to play the game and I was like, sure, I'm down to play it. So I looked at their development history and they're the same creators as the people who made Wrong Floor with that big creepy guy. And they also made that one where you like go to the apartment of your dead grandpa. And now they made another game called Nine Child Street Street demo so if it's on the same path as those games I already know I'm gonna hit some high notes but we are gonna click play and it says Armin the protagonist of our story was a very curious boy he is about to turn nine years old after his birthday he began to notice strange things happening in the abandoned house across the street one night when he saw the light in the window he finally decided to go to this mysterious house boy ain't even nine years old yet and he's already going into mysterious houses I really just have to suck it up everybody and this is how it starts Really? Oh, my caramba, I wow! Okay, get into the house. This is ridiculous. I already know I'm hitting high notes. My high notes are hitting high notes. Can I go in here? Any stinky belongs in the trash? Oh, here we go. I'm a nine-year-old boy. I can fit through here. Bro, I'm that short? Got the blades of the grass poking me in the freaking eyeballs. But yeah, something's going on in this house. And I'm already scared. <laughs> I'm stalling. I pretended my eye was itchy, but it's just nerves. I'm nervous. Okay, let's go inside. Can't go in there. Oh, shoot. Why am I playing this? It's Christmas. I should be playing, like, Disney games and singing along to Mariah Carey music. I shouldn't be playing scary stuff. Come on, man. All I want for Christmas is for these jump scares to stop, please. Oh, this is so freaking scary. I don't like it. Even the crickets sound scary. Okay, let's go inside. Please. Wait. Oh, I thought I saw somebody. If that one big guy from the other games is here, I'm done. I'm legit done. Oh, no. That's the window. Oh! Holy crap! Who was that in the window? I... 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 I, I just want to go. PLEASE! Okay. Examine the room with the light on the second floor. Okay, somebody was looking at me through this window, everybody. And there's a cabinet on the stairs? How the hell does that work? That shit don't even make no sense! Okay. Look how realistic this house looks, everybody. I can't. And then there's a random eye right here. Yeah, this house is haunted as shit. You see the objective in the menu. What is that? Oh, that's my flashlight. Okay. Let's just keep going. What was that? What the hell was that? Oh, fuck. Bro. The fact that I... Stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Oh my god. <gasps> I was one step away from a haunting happening. Is anybody here? Okay. It doesn't look like somebody just straight up abandoned this house. It looks like somebody's just like not home because there's books, there's television. It's everything super TV. Wow, okay. It's not just a regular TV, it's super. It's super awesome, dude. Okay. Let's not make jokes. Now's not the time for jokes. Can my flashlight stop being haunted as well? Like, holy shit balls, dude. Press F to turn off left. Oh, ah, fuck! God! Stupid ball, bitch! What are you, a Wilson? I always hate Wilson. What does that say? From Shilambinks and 88 Novorossiya Street. Hello, Jack. 
I'm a long-time fan of yours, and I really love your work. I would like to get an exclusive doll. Please answer! That ball scared the dickens out of me, dude. I was just trying to match the language here, the dickens. That looked like Leatherface. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Oh, man. Okay. Let's examine the light. Every time I make a comment, there's no light. I was waiting for you. Great, now I'm here. There's a freaking coffin in the corner, dude. This is for you, Armin. Leave the house. Oh my god. Please don't. Please don't. Oh, bro. Oh, I'm not Armin, but I'm Charmin Soft. Please don't. Why is that thing wiggling? That dude looked like he got a penis. <laughs> ah! I didn't think he was gonna come after me. That looks like a bowl of shit. It's not even a bowl, it's a plate. And that's a comb, right? No, it's not even a comb, it's a brush. I can't even say things correctly. Oh my god. Oh, that face looks messed up. Okay, let's leave the house. Wait, there's another cabinet on the stairs? How am I gonna get out of here? Look at that face! Bro, that... Man, that's... I can't. I can't with this game, everybody. I can't. I gotta go. Like, I really gotta get out of here. Why do you have pictures like this? Look at that. That just makes me feel bad. I always knew that children attracted me. They carry good in them. In my house and in me. This has always been absent. What? That sounds gross. What the hell are you talking about? What is that noise? I gotta go. It said leave the house. I'm leaving so fast. Please, please, please. Oh my god. Bro. I don't like the sounds in this game. Please let me go. Oh my god. No. Whew. I don't like that the flashlight just turns off whenever it wants to. It doesn't even listen to me. I get no respect. Come on. Oh. What the fuck, ball? Even the ball's trying to leave! That's how haunted this house is! Go! Bro. Let me leave! I... I'm sorry, everybody. I need it. Oh, God. Even the ball, when I press the escape button, it's still on. I'm already gonna lose my voice with this game. I already know. Let's leave that ball. I know there was another door. It's like a back door, right? Press F to turn on flashlight. I know! I've been doing that. Like, I've been... Oh, I thought that was somebody. It's the eye again. Why did it open like that? Oh, no. Why? If you hear crying, as an eight, almost nine-year-old kid, I think you're aware. You've got to be aware. Oh, dude, look at that. Hide? What do you mean, hide? What does that mean? Oh. What? What are we hiding from? If I open this and somebody's out here. Oh, now the thing's looking at me. I'm so freaked out. We can open everything? No. And there's binoculars? So the watcher has become the watchee? Is that what you're telling me? Clinics? That's off brand. That's off brand. Okay. Jay? Stop it. You got this, dude. Oh, fuck. Find the key. Oh my god. Alright. I have to find the key. It could be literally anywhere. And there's barely any light in this bitch. I can't see anything. Okay. We have to find some freaking key. Whew. This game is scary as hell. But you know what? I'm doing my best, everybody. I'm doing it for you. 
Like, there's no way I would play this shit on my own. This is a message for those who think I'm crazy. You'll be right, because I am. Really. Oh. Okay. Well, I don't care if you're crazy, as long as you tell me where the key is. Please be somewhere close. These shadows. Man, they're well done, because this thing is creeping me out. I keep thinking it's somebody. Can't see shit, though. Freaking nine-year-old height. I wish you were a little bit taller. Can't you be tall for your age? Can you? Why is your eyes closed? Oh! It's different faces! Okay, that's my bad. That's my bad. Is that a- that's a comb. Thought that was a key. Alright. Move, bitch! Stupid head getting in my way. Come on. Nothing. Alright. No problem. Key. Key, please. Key me, please. Yo, can somebody key your boy, please? Why can't I open that middle, bitch? Okay. Oh, I'm scared to turn around, everybody. Like, I'm on edge. I wonder where the key is. Like, is it in a drawer? Woof! What the heck? The guy made dolls, right? The guy who runs this shit? What the heck? I wonder if he made them out of actual kids. That doll wasn't there before. I know it deep in my heart. He's probably gonna disappear too. Nothing there? That's weird. T posing ass bitch. I'll see you soon. I'm gonna kick you right in the freaking chest. All right. Oh, not again. Not again. All right, everybody. He's gonna jump scare us. It's free real estate. Never mind. I thought. I thought. Oh. Please don't be around another corner. Please. Oh, thank you. He listened. The banyo. I don't know why the game does that. But you know what? I don't appreciate it very much. Man, the sounds? The background sounds? I don't know. It's just super unsettling. Fuck. Come on, come on. Nothing. Great. Nothing but disappointment. All right, everybody. I'm really going to try to find this key. Really going to try to find this key. Come on, Jay. Did I already read that? I don't reach. I need a chair. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's see what this says. Something Louise lives. She turned nine. I built her a slide in the backyard. Steve is my new nine-year-old friend. In honor of this, I built a swing. This kid is almost nine years old. He should not be here then. Whoever is in here, like an evil entity or something, is probably doing something when kids turn right nine years old. Or, you know what I mean, like, as soon as they turn nine years old, he like does something. Okay, my nose is really itchy. I don't know if it's a nervous itch or what, but I need to find a chair, right? Okay, I need to find a chair. It's gotta be this chair, right? <gasps> I got it. Okay, I'm pretty strong for an eight year old carrying chairs and shit. The thing's red. What? Bro. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, nice. Okay. Nervous itch again. I got the nervous itch. Let's go. Get me out of here. That really looks like Leatherface. Like, seriously. En serio. Stop, flashlight, please! I should have put some Duracells in this bitch before I came to this house, man. At least a two pack. The doll's still there. Leave me alone. Wait, the door's closed. I'm going to die soon. It doesn't really make me sad. I want to do the last job. Connect the children so that they live peacefully. Connect the children. Oh no. That better be paint. That better be paint. Oh fuck. It looks too bright to be blood. It's gotta be like doll paint, doll making paint or something. I'm just trying to be positive in this situation, everybody. What was the point of getting the key? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Oh my God. I can't, I can't, I can't with this game. Oh fuck, I hate the noises in this game. the hell I am so freaked out 
My under boobs are sweating, dude. Don't you dare turn off the flashlight, game. Don't you dare. Oh, that is disturbing as fuck. What the heck? Why? Why? You didn't need to do that, game. I was already freaked out. It was again a dream about this strange house. I'm still playing as the eight-year-old, right? But soon, Armin will go to it. He shouldn't, though. Because that house does something to nine-year-olds. I don't know if it actually makes the nine-year-olds into dolls or kills them and then replicates them into dolls. But that was the Nine Child Street demo from the creators of Wrong House and the other game that was super scary. I'm definitely going to keep my eye out on this one. Shout out to the developer again. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. Next game of today's episode is called Drive Time Radio. I'm not completely sure what this game is about, but from what I've seen, you're driving and somebody's talking on a radio, and I think that you can talk back, so maybe you called in. Actually, I'm pretty sure you called in, but we're stuck in traffic. And little fun fact about me, I have road rage. I talk so much shit. I talk shit in general, like in and out of the car, but in the car, for some reason, I don't know, the roasting is activated 24 seven. Like from the moment I started driving, if somebody's really slow in front of me, Man, shit talking all day, all night. This dude's snoozing. If he's snoozing, you're losing, my guy. Oh, okay. I guess we're gonna turn up. And that was the day with their. Oh, and I can actually drive. Oh no! You can catch them l -l 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 live at the Beach of Palooza Spring Break Beach Blowout. Be I want to get a blowout. <laughs> Where can I go for the blowout? What about you, Brett? Are you asking me if I'm gonna miss the Beach of Palooza Spring Break Beach Blowout? Not on your life, Bucko. You can bet I'll be there. <laughs> if you're just tuning in, you're listening to... Oh, Sounds like a Boston mobster. You bet on your life, Bucko. The one and only midnight show in the eternal void between physical dimensions. We're going to be with you all night long, so get comfortable. Hey, I'm comfortable. I'm, not too comfortable. I'm so comfortable, I'm not even here right now. Now, if you're a new listener, or you've been trapped here so long you've succumbed to madness, here's the shakedown. One lucky caller will get the chance to answer our <laughs> terrifying Oh, that? Question. Yeah. <laughs> and correctly, one prize is a grand prize, VIP weekend, platinum pass, all access, batch stage, celebrity experience, premium tickets to the Beach of Palooza <laughs> Spring Break Beach Blowout. What is that? What is that? Incorrect. I actually have to avoid things like that, don't I? Those are bodies. Those people had families. A tentacle? What is this tentacle hentai shit? This is the most cursed road ever. Hey, I think I should pull over and call the police or something. We got back to back to back to back uh, crashes. I was gonna say scratches. Back to back scratches. Damn. What in the world? Let's get our next contestant on the line and kick things off. Is that me? Oh, it is me. Hey there, Cola. You're on with Brett. And I didn't I even call you. You called me. Excited to be here. I'm the callee. I'm not excited the caller. You. And even more excited to get rid of these VIP tickets for the Beach Palooza Spring Break Beach Blowout. Look, All I just want to get the blowout, okay? Easy questions. I'm gonna take the blowout and dip. You'll be sipping cocktails. WKCR 92.3 VIP Beachside Bar and Grill. Sounds good. And yeah, if you do lose, we will devour your consciousness and use it to expand our own otherworldly existence. But hey, that's the price of doing business. Me All right, personally, Brett. I'm rooting for you, kiddo. I'm a little bit different. I'm not a kiddo. Uh, I don't like I'm over 30 years old. Much as Kyle does. So I'm going to be trying to kill you the whole time. Like so. Whoa! What the heck? Stay on your toes for those cool. Uh, I'm a sneaky little guy. I'll get you. Okay. But enough chit chat. Let's get to it. Let's do it. First You're question. making me nervous. What is the European name for soccer? Football. That is absolutely correct. Can I get my blow out now? We always start these things off easy. So let's see if you can handle the next question. All right. The Hit me. Hit me with it. Of the United States was the 20th. Who? Garfield man. That's correct. Garfield, Garfield cat. Are you serious? Lasagna, <laughs> a cat. A cat in the <laughs> office. Hate Mondays as well. 
Uh, no. He actually loved Mondays. He was a little piggy for Mondays. Your mom's a little piggy for Mondays. Okay, call the next question. In the year 1875, the capital of... It's Mike! What the... Ooh, nice reflexes, caller. Call us. Are you watching me? You though. Don't let me catch you. This game Seriously, is actually caller, sick. Do not let him catch you. All okay. right, caller. This next one's a doozy. So oh, I can actually speed up. Butt. You know Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin, but who was the first? Yeah, they're my homies. On the Apollo 11 mission. Uh, Jim Lovell. Ooh, sorry. Jim Lovell was on the Apollo 13 mission. Oh, that was right. Bro. My bad. Brett, come on. I was thinking about... about I have no idea who the hell the that was. All I'm saying is the facts don't add up. People are rightfully asking questions about the existence of the moon. <laughs> Brett, the moon is right there. We can see it. That you thing's huge. I was like, that's a hallucination we're creating by... That moon looks the moon swollen. Of this brain. Oh, oh, hold on, look. Oh, See, it's gone. Now it's a pizza pie. Now it's green. <laughs> it's not real, Kyle. Can <laughs> we please move on? This game is dope. And that's round one over. And I gotta say, two out of three, it's not bad. It's, it's not, not that good. It's not that bad. But it's enough to go to round two. Appreciate you. Thank you. We got round two coming up momentarily. But first, the weather. How's it looking out there, Brett? We're in a void of nothing. The void of substance, yet infinite. Imagine if there was somebody next to me looking at me. Imagine if it was Brett. Conscious, rationalizing the semiotic signals produced by our presence in this dimension. And just what does that mean for the weekend forecast, Brett? Well, we're gonna see scattered showers. I'm actually really feeling this game. And I'm really feeling that I have to burp. Hold on. Bray. Excuse Great me. Great to hear. All right, caller. Now it's time for. Round two? two. Yeah! Round two, round two, round two! One question right, and you're one step closer to those VIP weekend platinum pass all access backstage celebrity experience. Yes, sir. Premium tickets to the beach. Ain't a blow! Ain't a blow! Hey, hey can we send the gang to the blow? I gotta go with my gang. For a process called avoid melting. But hey, try not to think about it. Now, I'll never think about it because I just don't care. What is the twelfth element on the periodic table? Are you serious? Magnesium, please. That's correct. Let's go! Turn me up! Woo! Common symptoms of magnesium deficiency include muscle fatigue, muscle spasms, muscle weakness, muscle cramps, muscle numbness, and muscle death. Muscle death? You made that up. I've never heard of muscle death. Maximum size of a boat. Kyle, I'm sorry. I gotta interrupt. We have some breaking news. Why don't we ask about the maximum size of my dick? Really? Oh shit. Okay. Thank you, Brett. Appreciate you. You're the real MVP. Yeah, where you at? Eyewitnesses are reporting uh, uh, two or three more. Okay, let's go. One, two. Oh, you said two or three more, right? I'm being told there's one more. All right, let's get it. Right in the middle, too. Some Malcolm in the middle shit. Last no more. Are you freaking kidding me, man? That concludes our news report. Appreciate you, Brett. Okay. So, we got one out of one questions right. Let's get Next to round question. three, everybody. The Battle of Hastings took place on what? Weekday. <sighs> I mean, Saturdays are for the boys. Saturdays are for the gang. But I think there was a war on Saturday. That's right. Let's go! Saturday. Woo! <laughs> you know what I do? I'm the quiz master, baby! They sure don't. Ooh! We only view time morphographically as a single infinite instance. So no, some things really don't, haven't changed, will never change, and are, of course, are always have never not been changing. What key you is say, Beethoven's Kyle. fifth symphony in? What key? C minor. That's correct. Let's go. Hey, Brad, hit us Got those C, C cups on deck. Three out of three, baby. Yeah. My other hand is on the wheel. You Always have to have at least one hand on the wheel, everybody. Well, well, well. That's another three questions and another round in the can. Yeah, but son. How'd they do, Brett? A perfect score. A perfect score. You know, Mwah. Kyle. Look, I think three for three, you know? It's a shoo-in for those Beach Blues' spring break Beach Blowout tickets. 
It's not over yet though, Brad. We've got one more round left, and some would say it's the most challenging. Not for me though. Most mind bending. The most jaw How long is this damn road? The most uh, deadly. Oh yeah, That's foreshadowing. Right. It's the lightning round. Shoot. We're gonna okay. With a series of rapid fire questions, so stay on your toes. Oh, I'm on these toes. My toes are on my toes. These little piggly wigglies. Get ready. Here they come. All right, let's go. Square root of 144. Uh, 12. Who was the first pilot to circumnavigate the globe solo? The fuck? Charles Lindbergh. Sixth planet from the sun of your solar system. Are you freaking kidding me? Saturn? Far we've gone easy on you, caller. If you want those VIP weekend platinum pass all access backstage celebrity experience, did I get them all right? Gets to the Beach Palooza Spring Break Beach Blowout. What's the sixth planet from the sun? The real questions. I've just been handed the real questions by our producer Paulie. Paulie, Paulie, and Brett—they're definitely in a mafia. The constant on guard in a climate-controlled, hermetically sealed environment. They're that hard. All they're that hard? Well, I'm that dude. Nothing's too hard for me. Like Super mega ultra pause on that. What is the city with the highest elevation on Earth? Fuck. La Paz? Name the inventor of the elevator. F Alicia Graves? Which of these is a type of cheese? Um, Fischella? How many calories are in a gram of mayonnaise? What? 68. This ethereal dimension is ruled over by what entity? What the hell? Ah! The creature resides in the center of all entropy in the palace of... What the... What is the top speed of a grizzly bear? Uh... Please, please, please. Is any of this actually happening? No. Are you sure? Yes. The first Major League Baseball World Series was in what year? 1903. What is the answer to the first question we asked? Football. And that is it for the lightning round. Did I do it? What a rush. Did I do it? Honestly, Cola, you got real chops for survival. I did it! I'm the man! Out there, I thought you were a god. So many close scrapes. They're not out of the woods yet, though. I want to know how many I got right. Bear with us for a second. Okay. Holy crap. Everybody cross your fingers for your boy one time. Please. I'm crossing my fingers. Other hands on the wheel though. I have to drive responsibly. I know I'm gonna get clapped. Oh, you garbage. Car, we are just about ready to part ways with those Beach of Palooza spring break beach blowout tickets. We just have one last question for you. For sure. Are you ready for the best weekend of your life? Let's go! Hell yeah, baby! Well, that's great to hear, since you're tonight's grand prize winner. Yeah, you buddy! You are going to the Spring Break Beach Blowout. All right, I'm on my way Those there. VIP tickets grant you ooh, all access ooh. all weekend long. Ooh, ooh. That's unlimited access to the WKCR 92.3 Bar and Grill Boardwalk. That's Sweet. front row seats at the Beach of Palooza main stage. And that's unlimited refills on your choice of soda or other caffeinated beverage. Also, if you bring us your ticket, we can validate your parking. <laughs> oh, nice. No. That's the most important no. thing. No. Oh, God. We're not letting this one get away. It's been no. Cold. I am right. going to get away, no. Brett. And there's nothing you're going to do about it. They weren't supposed to win. We rigged this whole thing for a reason. <laughs> well, I didn't even <laughs> ask for this. Oh, oh, Brett, let's not throw words like rigged. Okay, <laughs> hold your horses. Everyone at WKCR 92.3 takes the rules very seriously. I don't care about the rules. Oh I shit. I don't care about fear. <laughs> I'm sick and tired of this radio show, bitch. Whoa, whoa, whoa Brad. I almost hit that one. What the heck? You, you don't like the radio show, bitch? I, th I thought we were having fun. I've never liked what? Show me then. <laughs> Show me then, you big bitch. Caller, you enjoy those VIP tickets. I will. Oh, no, you don't. I'm gonna take it your mom. Belongs to me. Fuck. <gasps> I should have went around. I should have went around. Yes. 
Please. I can't believe I tried to go through. Yo, I tried to squeeze yo, through like some butt cheeks. Yo, Falk, get in here and give me a hand. I'll give you the part of his brain that feels on weak. I know that Falk you think. Holly signed a contract just like everyone else, Brent. He knows the rules of the Brent Kyle show. What rules? What the hell? All of this is just an amber more fight. Fuck, 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 fuck. Brains. No. Oof. Let me slow down. Let me slow down. Let me slow down. I'm going way too fast. There we go. Just keep swerving. There we go. Nope. Come on. No freaking way, game. <laughs> oh, shit. What's going on over there? Come on, man. Can somebody please turn me up? Like you don't even respect the sanctity of Beachapalooza anymore. Oh, uh, I do, I do. I love Beachapalooza. Who doesn't, right? Am I right? Of Just trying to get on their good side, everybody. I don't give a double doggy style damn about Beachapalooza. I'm just trying to go home. That's what the quiz show is for. We'll get another one right after we let this contestant go. Oh, no. I want this one. Why? Is it because of my juicy ass? It's gotta be because of my juicy ass. I'm ending this now. Oh shoot! Great. Damn it, Brett. Great. Hold on, caller. What the? This is gonna get messy. What the? So no matter what happened, I was gonna get clapped. It was just a matter of time of the clapping, the clapping. All right. Okay. I hate when games end like that. Like no matter what you do, you're gonna die anyway. So whatever. Oh shit! I'm a bitch of a loser, bitch! Turn me up! Now give me my blowout! Alright! Come on, who's ready to rock? Answer it. Drive Time Radio. That was sick! I enjoyed that game a lot. I love games where you have to answer questions and there's just so much pressure on you to get it right. I think I'm gonna end free random games on this note right here. This game was actually so cool and unique. I don't think that I wanna top it in this episode, so we're just gonna leave it at this cool experience. If you want me to play another episode of free random games, make sure you give this video one big fat like, and tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!